They may have a either broke or bent real far. I think it's broke. So that was a bad idea. I'm gonna have to. Yeah, I believe it did break it. Broke it off. Dang it. Not doing good. So. I guess this jar is going to get its first screw in the bottom. Here's clips. Lasted from 1993 until Don got a hold of it in 2021 for the last time. I won't throw it away yet. I don't think it's use. I mean, you can't fix those. They're, they're kind of metal. I have a welder, but you can't weld something like that. Or I can't. It's a... Uh, spring steel uh, very hard and brittle that's why it just snapped off like that when the door fell so far but uh okay how am i gonna his problem is oh yeah there is a, it gets way thinner down at the bottom I'm thinking that uh, I may get it in here. Well, those two clips will hold it. There's two on this side. Get it back in there. <clears throat> Put the screws on the top. There's two screws in the top. And then I may flip it on its back and put put a couple of screws in the bottom. A lot of them have screws in the bottom. Okay. Yeah. So, oh, I need to find those screws before I go back at it again. Like, I need those screws. I can't let go of it to look for them. Figure out which ones I want. Uh, that I think I... There was two screws that were... I didn't think to mark every, everything. Like, I, I was thinking, well, why didn't I... I didn't want to t didn't want to take time to label them, but then it hit me. Well, I've got a bunch of different color markers. Why didn't I just take and put a different color? Or one, you know, like if I got matching screws, I put the same color on all of them and on where they go, and then um, those are screws for the the old three old screws for the. Uh, Trailer hitch ball mount for the back, the baby trailer hitch ball. Okay, what do we got here? Yeah, those two, these are the two that I put in there. Right here. Might seem better by my shirt, I don't know. And then these are the two that I believe go in there because they match this one that goes in the center. It's kind of goofy because, well, they I can see that they held all right, but these are the ones I put in the top part of the door. And they are... You know what? I'm going to get my calipers. I think they're the uh, same... Uh, some, a couple of things I got new screws for with the new parts. I'm going to grab my calipers. Okay. Um, where's my magnifying and the magnifying glass? All right. Now, anything else? <sighs> Shut this caliper lid and put it down. So where I've got it setting is a good place for it to get not get knocked off or and. Uh, be mad about a bit of something else. I, I knocked off my, uh, I had a, well, a bunch of greet, uh, business cards and other stuff set, and, and a little wooden thing that was holding them and I knocked that off on the way. Well, I went back in to get something I forgot and knocked it off. I've just been going in circles messing things up. 
Okay, so let's see. That is one hundred and sixty-five thousandths on the outside of the threads. That's all I'm really worried about right now. I just want to know. Yeah, I thought so. And that is one hundred and ninety, really. A little less. <coughs> this thing's not. It's pretty old. I've, let's see when? Oh yeah, I bought this in nine. I bought it in '79, I think. Yeah, '79, the first year I got hired on at General Dynamics. Recalls 30th of September '93. That was the last time it was calibrated. '93. I thought I got laid off in '92. I must have made it up into '93 then. So that'll tell me when I got last time I got got uh, to work at General Dynamics. All right. So. Uh. I was thinking I might turn. Yeah, that's probably making it too. Just enough. Uh, as long as I can see, I'll leave the lights off because it just washes the extra light off because it washes everything out. So uh, on camera, and I tried. That's an, I tried before I came out. I did a test by bringing down the exposure one to negative one and uh, in the camera settings, and it uh, looked made my face look good and stopped having the. In my, well, I was in my room, but it stopped having the white reflection on my head but then I noticed everything else was just too dark around so I thought well I want that might make nothing show up all the doors where they where they go in uh, so yeah here we go I don't know if I can get it in the camera though without I, I guess I really am a little higher than I wanted to be anyway. For it's, I can't get me and the thing in there, or I, I could if I got way far back, but I don't want to be, you know, way far back. So I'm going to do that. That way you can see a little bit of the main work area, you know, every part of it. Yeah, when this is put in there. It, uh, the smaller screws went in and there's a little, you know, deal for it to go into. A little metal clip thing that holds screws better than just the, just the, uh, uh, sheet metal would do. You know, it's hard, it's hard spring steel like, like the, uh, getting me a driver. Like those springs. They're not exactly, it's kind of like, it is a spring, I mean. These clips, they all have a spring mech component to them. Yeah, these bigger ones would be the ones that stay, would get in there and stay. And these little ones, let me make sure. Then they have to go to the door on the back. Let's make sure. I'm not going to spin the dryer around. Oh! Make sure there. Having a little trouble figuring out where they go. I guess I can put it on there. Since I'm already down here trying the screws. Just can't seem to do anything. I didn't. Get, I don't have the right size of driver on my deal. I'm not sure why I can't get it started. I just guess I just need to uh, try harder. My chair was how I was. I can reach that from a chair. I, I really don't do good at getting up and down or squatting or anything. 
and I wore myself out yesterday working so long on everything. Okay, well, I'm sitting on my phone. I don't know why it turned way around there. The phone is what tra is what's transmitting the mic over Bluetooth to the receiver over there on the camera. Better look. When I did that, it could have turned stuff off or anything. So let me. I'm looking. Make sure I didn't mess up. Turn it off or something. Let's see. Connected. Alt mic on. Okay. I guess that tells me. That also will tell me, of course, that's more trouble, but that will tell me if the Bluetooth is connected by looking at that window. But I can also just look at this here. The receiver, if it's flashing blue, it's getting, it's got Bluetooth connection. Uh, okay. Sure. There we go. I had to shift the door a little bit was all I needed. Okay. Now. You know, I think I'm starting to... I, see, I'm, I got diabetes and, and it's hard to tell when sometimes I I think I might be hungry, but I'm uh, really not. And uh, then five or ten minutes later, you know, I'm shaking and can't really stand up. Not well. Maybe I am getting on the edge of shaking right now. I got a feeling that's why I'm messing everything up. That's the first. That's one of the. Well, I, get, I don't know. I guess I'm not. I'm not always working on stuff like this. So uh, I'm usually on the computer. So. Uh, usually what I notice is, now went blank. So anyway, yeah, that's one of the things I notice is going blank. Oh, this, yes. That clip is what I need working to get the, uh, yeah, that can stay there, I guess, but it would probably look better. How did I do that? I bet all day yesterday, I did, well, I made noise yesterday, but it wasn't with that door. <laughs> Let's see. Trying to figure out how to hold this while I try to get that, uh, my little fix went, went too far. It's uh, supposed to be sticking up right there a little bit so you can clip it on, to, just enough to clip it onto the... And I squeezed it with these uh, needle nose vice grips and uh, too much. There. That about right. That's it in there. Oh, that's why I've got my magnifying glass. Yeah, good. So that's why that kept acting up. Okay. You are the screwdriving mechanism that I need. And, uh, Put you in there. Right there. You can't, it falls off every time for as long as I can remember that I open the door. 
and it must have been well I think that part of it's I don't want to mess with it anymore because I think it's just in too too bad a shape that's upside down why would it be going like that maybe this one's upside down huh it lets me turn it Ah. I wonder if it'll go in there either way. But those don't fall out. They don't even... I can see now where it would... You might want it on the bottom. Or does that push it out of there? No. It doesn't push it out of there. I'm gonna try. These other ones will always seem to work good. It may not line up. Let's see. Yeah, it don't line up like that. It has to go the other way. Yeah. And I guess I've got it a little bit too open again. This time I won't use the vice grips. I'll just use these needle nails and see if I can close it some down too much. Now I see why it's always falling out. <coughs> There. Okay. Yeah. Screws are in my pocket. Yeah, so these clips should help. If I can find what I do with my gloves now that I moved everything around. I want my gloves while I'm doing this because everything's sharp and I don't want to be all cut up. It makes it kind of harder sometimes, you know, more fumbly, but. You gotta lift up the drum. You gotta get this, uh. I think it's good to go, okay. There's like four or five things that have to line up. Let's see. I'm thinking about it, I'm going to plug up this switch wires for, uh, well, not until I'm sure that I'd, I've got it in, the, in there right. That part there, I think it's sticking out because I, I don't have the thing on the bottom. Okay. It just didn't look like the drum was far enough that way, but now I guess I realize it is. Okay, well, I'm going to put my screws in there now. Get another drink. <laughs> yeah, okay. <sighs> this. There we go. This thing is not magnetized enough to hold a screw. Barely even holds it. it. Won't hold it in there right. The mag. This is has. A, it's aluminum and has a magnet in it, and it just don't magnetize that enough. I need to just go through and magnetize all these things on their own. <sighs> Let's see. I can get that. I can't see. Crooked. I know what I need to do, but I need both hands in here. I need to raise that up. Oh. It kind of feels like my. I might even have the two, one size too big of a driver. Let's try the other one. gotten so crooked can't even get anything on it now I'm gonna use these 
baby vice grips and get it out of there. I think. I thought I hadn't been able to turn it enough. Yeah, there we go. It was just jammed in there a little bit. Now let me make sure I wasn't using the wrong... Nope. The problem is... Oh, might be metric. I wouldn't think as old as this is it'd be metric, but it's metric. The one I was using was American. Didn't like that. Okay, so if maybe if I stick my foot up against the... I can't even see what I'm doing that way. Okay. Boy, that clip sure was helpful. Now that it's not there, it's a really real pain. Get this lined up and going. I just realized that I have a screwdriver. There we go. Pull it off of there. It didn't work. I don't think it's hitting this hole. There it is. Yep, a screwdriver, I'm gonna need it. I'm going without gloves, but... I don't think I'm gonna be able to... I was thinking I could pull it in with the screw if I could get the screw started. Get it to line up. Okay, we gotta figure out something better than that. Cause that ain't working. <coughs> First thing. <coughs> these back on when I start messing around with those sharp areas. I can get my baby vice grips in there. Raise it up with the screwdriver. And get those where they at. Just getting where they're going to be tied. These are needle nose ones. They're long. They may be re able to reach. Oh, I don't need to go that way. Oh, wait. Where's the... Yeah, okay. Yeah, there's enough flange in there to do that. So... Get my regular screwdriver. Swap sides here. Regular screwdriver. Raise it up. Oh, let me go get my scratch all. That's how I can line that up. Had it out all day yesterday using it. But this should make me able to line it up. This time I'll try to remember to keep my knee on it. There. Now if I can get it clamped into place. <coughs> <coughs> 